Okay, today we're going to look at a couple Subaru oil filters. A one in Made in Japan oil filter, number 15208AA160. And a Made in USA oil filter that I opened from a previous video, number 15208AA158. And I got this Made in USA oil filter at SubaruParts.com for $6.40 plus shipping. But you'll be able to find it cheaper somewhere else. And I've seen these Made in Japan Subaru oil filters on Amazon for $20, but I got it for free. Yep, a generous viewer sent me this filter. His name is Jeff Korch from Okonomowoc, Wisconsin. Thanks, Jeff. And these fit his 2021 Subaru Crosstrek. Yep, the one with a 2.5 liter engine. And these two are gonna duke it out. Could get ugly, folks. And when the dust clears, we'll see which one is the better filter. So let's get started. It's just a network. You gotta glue the silicone in this pipe. Get your inner ear filtration. Okay, let's start with the blue one. We'll start with the Made in USA oil filter. Since this one already has been cut open from a past video, I'll put up a section of that video right now and you'll be able to see what this filter looked like before it was cut open. Okay, the filter comes wrapped in this plastic, no box. Let's take a look at it here. Made in USA. I believe this is a date code. A13223. She has 10 inlet holes. You see a metal core with holes. This will be a bypass valve down below. And that looks to be a nitro rubber anti drain back valve. Nitro rubber gasket fits right inside the groove here. Yeah, it's got a nice little lip there. Comes off easier and it goes back on. Okay, there it goes. Yeah, that all looks nice. <laughs> okay, and here's the black oil filter. Subaru made in Japan oil filter. And she comes in a box just like this, just a plain white box with the numbers on it. Nothing fancy. Okay, she comes with this plastic protective protection over the base plate. And uh, the date code, I believe this is a date code, 8L0A. And you can see right on here, made in Japan. She has six inlet holes. Six inlet holes, bypass valve down below, metal core with holes, a lot of threads there. And this is a pre lubed gasket. It also looks the same as the blue one. And they're pretty good. It goes, fits right into this groove right here. Yeah, so that's all nice. It's got a lot less inlet holes, but the rest of it so far looks kind of the same. Yeah. Okay, let's compare it to the blue one. About the same height, same size. Totally different base plates. Made in USA, made in Japan. Alright, I say we cut the black one open and see how these two compare. Be right back. Okay, so here they are both cut open. Let's get their weights. We'll start with the blue one, 180 grams. The black one is 230 grams. The base plates. The blue one is 81 grams, the black one was 91 grams. Mm -hmm. Let's take a look at these guys. Well, you got a lot more inlet holes on the blue one, the Made in USA. The Made in USA is on my right, Made in Japan on my left. But you got a lot more threads here on the 
made in Japan one. Yep, a lot more threads. And let's say the gaskets here, they're nitro rubber gaskets, about the same same thing. Oh, Danny drainback valves. Both nitro rubber. Slightly different shapes, but this one's the, for the main Japan one. And this is the Made in USA one. They both cover the holes up nicely. I'll show you right now what this filter element looked like before it was cut up. And the filter element. Filter element weighs 40 grams. A metal crimp seam. And I counted 49 pleats. And I couldn't find any information on the filter media, so I don't, you know, what you see is what you get. I don't have no micron rating or what it's made out of. Now, this looks a lot like a Fram made filter, so I'm assuming it could be made by the same company. It's a nice crimp seam, though. You can see the spots there. Look at that. Yeah, it feels nice. And bypass valve, 10 grams, and the can, can weighs 46 grams, and I was getting like 0.4 millimeters for thickness, 0.39 mil, well, yeah, it's, it's about 0 0.4, 0 0.41 millimeters. It's about average, 0.4 to 0.5 is about average. This is printed on, by the way. And the filter media. Is. 2.40 inches wide. Yeah, you got these cardboard paper end caps. They're glued really nice, though. Okay, so let's go to the black filter. The filter element weighs 76 grams. And she's got a metal crimp seam right here. I counted 56 pleats. And same with the as with the blue one. I don't know what the filter is made out of, what the filter media is made out of, or what the micron rating is. Couldn't find anything out about it. It's got nice metal end caps. Bypass valve right here. And stamp leaf spring. Doesn't have much of an arc to it, but it weighs seven grams. And the can alone weighs fifty-four grams. Let's get the Measurement is can. Point fifty millimeters. Yeah, that's probably about right, about fifty millimeters. Feels a little bit thicker. Yeah, it's a little bit thicker than the blue can. Yeah, this one's got seven more pleats. So uh let me get a width on it also. Two point two eight inches wide. It's got a lot more pleats, so it's probably gonna be longer. Alright, let's cut this one open and we'll compare it. To this blue one. Be right back. Okay, here they are stretched out. And the Made in USA filter is 53 and 3 quarter inches long. And the Made in Japan oil filter is 57 inches long.
They're almost identical in square inches. Okay, let's get the thickness on this filter media. We've got U here for USA. Exactly 1 point millimeters. 1.0 millimeters. In the Japan, I got J for Japan. Point eight five millimeters. Let's take a look at these guys up close. Yeah, you can see the the made in Japan on my right is thinner. Yeah, it's a little bit thinner. You can tell. You know, it feels more like a paper actually to me. Also, just my opinion, but. Whereas uh, the USA one feels like a, probably a blend. Almost feels like a super tech oil filter. But they both have about the same filter media. And that's about the only thing they have in common. Let's look at the rest of the filter. So the Made in Japan one has metal end caps. Made in USA has these paper cardboard end caps. Two different kind of bypass valves the holes you can see the made in japan on my left has a lot more holes and you know this the stamp leaf spring different design because of this or bypass valve but they both got nitro rubber any drain back valves and the base plates are a lot different the one on the USA it's got a lot more holes but the made in Japan ones got more threads so which one of these oil filters would you want to use in your Subaru Please post your comments down below. And I want to give another shout out and thank you to Jeff Korch for sending me this oil filter. Thanks Jeff. So I think I'll wrap this video up. Don't forget Oil Filter Friday. I open up a new automotive oil filter every Friday on this YouTube channel. So if you like this video, please hit that like button. Thanks for watching and take care. The filter media for the Subaru Japan made oil filter is 17 grams. The filter media for the USA Subaru made filter is 20 grams.